And welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders. We've got ourselves a defense mission. Let's do it. Actually, no, let's not do it. I just realized it's almost nighttime. I do not want to fight at night. So let's go to bed real quick. Actually, before I do that... Is there anything else I can grab right now? I don't think so. And I don't think I can make any better items or any better weapons or equipment yet. Uh, let's see. Ooh, maybe throwing stones might be a good idea, but I don't have any pumice. Honestly, yeah, I don't really need those. What I would like, though, is not in this station. It's actually at the sewing station. Kind of forgot I separated these two. Whoops. No, I don't want to sit. I want to access the... Oh my god, I might get rid of these chairs. Okay, yeah, you know what? Go away, you stupid chair. I'm gonna move you over here real quick. There. There we go. Okay. So anyways, I want to make myself an iron broadsword, but I don't have the materials. I need rusty nuggets for that. And I can't get those yet. A leather shield would actually be a really good idea. You know what? It's fine. I think my equipment will be fine as is. Let's just go to bed. And then I'll start that mission in the morning. But yeah, honestly, right now, I'm thinking maybe a giant wall around the town might be a good way to uh, defend it. We'll see. But for now, let's just defend with what we have. I'm still thinking moat might be a good idea. I'm going to have to see where enemies actually spawn, though. Unfortunately, enemies don't get damp. The problem is, yeah, like I said, enemies don't get damaged by the poison. So, we'll have to see how this works. So, they spawn right there. Yeah, I'm trying to think of what would be a good way to... Yeah, honestly, Moat might be the best way to defend the town. We're already a water-based town, so it makes sense. Also, yeah, my weapons... I really need to upgrade my weapons. The Stone Axe is the strongest thing I can get right now, unfortunately. Also, I need to be careful not to access- Am I paralyzed? I'm paralyzed. Also, yeah, I need to build myself a shield. Oh my god. I hate being paralyzed. I'm gonna use a Tingle Tablet. The problem with being paralyzed is that you get stunned every few seconds, even if you're in the middle of an attack animation. So I'm just gonna let my townspeople take care of the enemies from now on. They're actually doing a pretty good job at it. But yeah, while they're doing this, I'm just going to take a quick look around. I think a really deep moat would probably be the answer. Along with maybe a small wall around it. Oh hey, scare wolves. Oh wait, I just remembered something about scare wolves. I think they can inflict confusion. Yeah, they can inflict confusion. That might be a problem. Confusion only reverses my control, so it's not that big of a deal. That being said, when this happens, it can be a problem. Also, I think that's the boss right there. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna be chopping at you until you die. Again, you are undead. Also, since I got some more fur, I can make myself a shield. Which I will probably do after this battle. There we go. Well, not a horrible battle. Could have gone better. Also, Red Town Portal. Awesome. Also, God Quest. Actually, are you the only quest I have right now? Yep. Okay, Ancient Palace. Gotta find someone called Thalamus. Ooh, that sounds... Actually, that kind of sounds filthy, considering what the Kuma Sutra is. Did you just say growing crops? So, yeah. We need to unlock farming. Somehow, every single game I play somehow goes back to farming. But, we'll go check that out. So, yeah. I need to go find the Farmer Sutra. Before we go there, there are a couple things I want to do. For one thing, I need to grab some food. Uh, do we have any ready-made food at the moment? The answer is... Yep. I will grab those. 
Oh, hi, hi, Ellie. Well, at least she likes her job. But yeah, I, I'm thinking next time we have a defense mission, I'm gonna set up a moat around town. Right outside town limits. But I'll worry about that later. Right now, there is one other thing I want to do. I want to make myself a shield. Because right now, my defenses are pretty lacking. There we go. So that'll help a bit. I have a second axe already, so I'm fine on that front. My armor is getting a bit worn down. I might, might want to make myself a second copy soon, if that ever breaks. Alright, sounds good. I was going to head through the red tunnel portal, but I should probably heal up before I go. I kind of don't want to go through at half health. Also, Garcelle's another dream. I like how they just go through the entire spiel for that uh, that memory. There we go. All right, let's go. So yeah, we're rested. We're fully equipped. We have our floating tree in the background. Time to head through the red tunnel portal. I do want to find a good place for these at some point. Oh wait, no, no. Before we go, how could I forget? We have sick people in need. And you know what sick people love? But whoops. Balloons. That'll help them get better. Alright, anyways, time to go. Let's just stick this over here. Yeah, I think I might make a shrine or something to them later at some point. Maybe like right outside town. I don't really need to put them inside town, because monsters don't really care about these. Also, oh my god, that's a lot of quests. Well, let's just pick these all up right now. Nosh, just tell me what you want. Sure. Oh. I'm not sure if I can really help you with that. Oh my god. Kind of forgot just how snarky our character is. Um, sure. Oh, you want me to Im improve the, uh, what is it, the kitchen, huh? Alright, we'll build you that barbecue. Actually, I think I have the materials I need already. Alright, so we'll have to build a barbecue for him. I would hope not, considering she's like 20 and he's like 70. Um, you have to be more specific about the water. We have water everywhere. Alright, so he, he wants us to build, or she, yeah. She wants us to build some type of filter fountain, which we have the idea for. I don't know if, the, if I have the materials for that yet, but I'll check. And what does Ellie need? Do you, okay, yeah. We have more people we need to grab. Great. Oh, yeah, that's true. Half our beds are full right now. Actually, over half right now. Alright, we need to find two people. Alright, if I find them, I'll grab them and bring them back here. Uh, for now, though, there is something I want to check. Do I have the materials to make the barbecue and the kitchen or the uh, filter fountain yet? Brick barbecue, what am I missing? Oh, I need bricks, rusty nuggets, and a cook fire. Okay, so I don't have the materials for that yet. I will soon, though, because I think I can get all those through the red tunnel portal. And then we need to make a filter fountain. Do I make that here or over at the... Okay, yeah, I need to go to the sewing city. Oh, wait, it might be in the Urbanist Cauldron, actually. 
Healing cream? No, it's not over here. Yeah, I think it's at the sewing station. Alright, what do we got? Huh. Wait, where is the recipe for this? Or do I not have the proper crafting thing yet? Or did I just completely miss it? I might have just completely missed it. One second. Huh. Oh, I might not have the thing to build the, the uh, filter. No, wait, no, there it is. I just completely missed it because when I changed pa Never mind. So what do we need for this? Stone, pumice, cotton, and a begonia leaf. Okay. Pretty much it just translates to grab everything you can and hope for the best. But we wasted enough time. Let's go. Time to go explore the new area. Leaving this poisonous swamp to go into a... Not quite as poisonous swamp. Okay, yeah, we're just in the wetlands. That's fine. If you haven't noticed yet, water is very important to this area. Also, I do need begonia leaves, so I'm just gonna grab these. Gonna get rid of you real quick. Alright, so that's all the leaves I need. They're everywhere, so I can just come back here and just grab some real quick. We got ruby and- oh, we got coal. I'm gonna grab the coal real quick. I don't- actually, no, I don't think there's iron in this chapter at all. In order to get iron equipment, we have to get rusty nuggets. Which I know where to get those. There's also silver and uh, rubies in the walls, but I don't think I really need those at the moment. There's also something over there. If I ever need ruby or iron, or not iron, uh, ruby or silver, I'll come out here. Oh, is that a... Oh, hi, Mildred. You have a silly name. Apologies to everyone. Yeah, she needs to be brought back. Well, we're right next to the tunnel portal. But I have stuff I need to do. So, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna... Actually, no, I should just take him back. I was just gonna leave them right here and then come back for them later, but... This isn't gonna take that much time. Might as well do it now before I forget. Also, I might just go back to sleep so I can start the day over. I'll fix her later. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna make sure I have plenty of time to explore the new area, so I'm gonna go back to sleep. There's no way I'm gonna be making that time limit li uh, time limit challenge, but I never try to make that time limit challenge, so it doesn't matter. All right, perfect. Let's head back. All right, so right now we need to find sick people. Uh, we need to find materials for a brick kitchen. Materials for a... Whatchamacallit? A filter fountain. And then we need to find the way to unlock farming. Yeah, we have a lot to do in this area. First things first, though, let's get out of the swamp. Oh, I also need... I forget where I can find pumice pieces, though. I'll have to double check where I can grab those. But yeah, right now, our goal is in this direction. Oh, there's one. Oh, I think that's a sick person. I'll grab them later. Oh, hey! Slime area! It doesn't do anything, it's just cute. I don't like cute. I'm gonna go destroy it. That's a lie, I love cute things, but... Oh, we also need cotton, that's right. So I might as well grab these while I'm here. But yeah, there's just a random little slime, like, shrine out here. It doesn't do anything, but... It's here if we ever need it. It's not even made of anything, anything like rare, so I'm not gonna break it for once. Oh, we got. Oh wait, I am starving. We are still some tree enemies. I'm actually going to ignore those guys for now. Not really sure if I can really take them on at the moment. But yeah, I'm looking for a very specific type of enemy, and there it is: skeletons. I want to kill skeletons. Because they drop rusty shra er, rusty shards, rusty nuggets. So yeah, with this I can make a ton of stuff. This is basically where we're gonna get all of our iron equipment from. Iron axe. Ooh, I could. Ooh, an iron axe would be really good. 
I can also want to make myself an iron sword, an iron shield. Basically, I need to kill a lot of skeletons. So if I see any more, I'm just going to get rid of them. Also, free uh, furniture. I will be taking all of these, if you don't mind. Also, I'll be stealing your walls, because they're mine now. You're not using them. Whoever owned this castle before me. Oh, there goes my axe. I'll well, have a second one. Also, I just realized my armor is getting close to breaking. That's what that little icon in the corner means. Your armor is really low durability. Is there any more furniture I can grab? Eh, I can grab more pumice pieces. And more walls. Oops. This is fine. Yeah, I might make myself another... Oh, it's broken. Eh, that's fine. I might make myself a second... Hi there! I was gonna say iron axe, but... I'm gonna make myself an iron axe. Once I get enough... That's a chest. Once I get enough, uh... Rusty nuggets. I don't see very many skeletons here, though. Also, I'm taking the sign. It's mine now. Also, I'm just gonna make sure I'm on my medicinal herbs. I need to make more medicinal herbs. Magidrakis. Where are all the skeletons? Usually there's a ton of them that spawn in this area. Also, I'm getting rid of you. Didn't drop anything. Huh. Yeah, there's not a whole lot of skeletons in the area. Eh, that's fine. I think they spawn more in this area over here. Also, yeah, if you haven't noticed, we're ex not exactly in the wetlands anymore. Pretty sure stone walls are natural. What they are, though, are mine. I'm taking them. Yeah, I'm thinking I could probably just completely revamp my town at some point, make it look a lot better with all this brick, instead of the dirt that we're using at the moment. It would probably do better in the wetness, too. Also, one more thing about these guys. They, uh, they come back to life once, the red ones. So you gotta beat them down twice. The yellow ones, though, they're pretty easy to deal with. That being said, I'm gonna heal. Hi there. I'll be taking your iron nuggets, or your uh, rusty nuggets, please. Thank you. Okay, I'm just gonna take care of this guy and then move on. So let me see. We need to head east. Alright, so once I take care of this guy, I will move on. I just want plenty of rusty nuggets to work with when I get back. I'm not going to bother with the red ones for now. Also, right, I need to actually be careful because there are a lot of magic users in the area. And they will fireball me to death if I'm not careful. Also, I'm starving again. I am not in that great of shape right now. Oh, skeleton boy. I miss my bombs. They would help out so much in this area. Ow. Help out so much in this area. Stop moving. I'm gonna be fireballed soon, aren't I? Yep. I heard it. I heard the sound cues. Wait, what the? Oh, right. Empty inventory slots again. That's a boss. Well, mini boss. If I want the farmer suture, I need to kill it. But I'm not sure if I can actually take it at the moment. Nope, I am leaving. I will come back for you. Oh wait, I need to pick up that sick guy I found on the way here too. Yeah, let's leave. Wait, what attack? Oh, slime. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna come back here once I have some better equipment. For now, let's just head back home. I would warp back, but I want to grab that guy we saw on the way here. Just so I don't have to make a second trip for them. Also, I might want to slay a couple more skeletons on the way back. Hi there! Oh, bye. Also, I'm just going to grab a couple more wall blocks. Because I need to make the uh, use these to make a filter fountain. Oh, cotton. Yeah, I'm just going to grab all the materials. You know what? Screw doors. I'll make my own door. Actually, I can make my own door now. Alright, so where were they again? Uh... They're over there. There's also fruit over here. Oh, and that's a fake tree. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother with you for now. I will let you live in peace. Goodbye. Also heart fruit. I can eat those. Actually, I'm out of food, aren't I? 
how did you get... Okay, how are the monsters doing this? Actually, to be fair, this is probably what I would do if I was trying to capture someone. I would just seal them in an underground vault or something. Actually, I kind of did that last chapter, didn't I? Here, I'm gonna deal with these guys before I rescue them. I'm gonna need more healing items when they get back. Alright. I'm here. Is that a sconce? Yes, it is. Alright, what was I saying? Alright, oh, I'm here. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Yeah, they sealed him all the way underground. That was honestly kind of impressive of them for trees. Alright, let's get him back to the tone portal. Uh, what will be the fastest way back? Yeah, they're here. Hopefully I have all the materials I need to build everything when I get back. If I have to, I might just grind a bit off-screen to get some more, uh, rusty nuggets. Uh-oh, it's dark. This is fine. Let's just get to the teleportal and then head back. I might just slam you on the ground and just jump into bed real quick just to make them despawn. Alright, we're back. I need to go to bed, so you just wait right there. I'll put you in your bed in the morning. Actually, do we have any- we don't have any spare beds. I might just stick some- get someone out of bed then. Alright, come along. Oh, right, I forgot we can't climb while we're carrying someone. Yeah, we don't have an empty bed, so, uh, y oh wait. That's right, I can't get them out of bed manually. I can do that, though. Oh, right, put it back into storage. Uh, let me grab that back out. Actually, you know what? I forgot I could also do this if I wanted to. Wait, wait me not enough space. Oh, there's someone sleeping there. There we go! That still counts! Oh, wait, you're not the person I wanted. You can, uh, just wait right there. I don't know. It does seem better for them to be out of the water like this, to be honest. Alright, so what do we need? A cooked crab claw and a cooked sardine. I don't think I have any sardines, do I? I have a cooked crab claw. I can do that. Uh, but yeah, I don't think I have any sardines. Oops. have any sardines. Unless someone made some. No, they just made mushrooms and eggs. I'll have to get a sardine at some point. Not right now, though. I don't know if I should keep them above water, though. The water is good for you. Maybe once they start getting out of bed, I'll start sticking the beds up above water. Uh, but I'll worry about that later. For now, let's build a couple of things. For one thing, I need... Let's build the filter fountain first. What am I missing? Cook fire. Actually, I can just do this. I will take that real quick. Just so I can Oh, hi Jacob. No, I, Jacob, no, I don't I don't care. I'm going to build myself a brick barbecue first. And then I'm going to make a I really should make myself some new clothes, but I'll worry about that later once my clothes have completely fallen off my body. Uh, what else was I looking at? Filter fountain. What am I missing? I'm missing stock. Uh, stocks? Stones. Well, I can get those pretty easily. Alright, now the question is do I have room for a brick barbecue here? Yes, yes, I do, surprisingly. So, yeah, we can get some bare food out of that at least. Nosh, don't eat the barbecue. But yeah, we can get some pretty good fish and cook those up if we wanted to. Oh, okay, so apparently having meat makes him into a weapons expert. Or not. Yeah, he needs fish. That's fine, more orange oil. Alright, so now we need, uh, let me see. 
I need to make myself some better equipment. So let me just do that real quick. Alright, so the first thing I want is a iron broadsword. So that'll help me fight things better. Actually, how much stronger is that? 14, 20, yeah, that's a huge upgrade. I'm gonna make myself an iron axe, because now I can break pretty much everything I find on the other side. I'm gonna need wood, actually. Uh, one should be enough for now. I want to make myself... I was going to make myself an iron shield, but I don't have the recipe yet, so never mind. Yeah, I would like a second iron axe, but I think one is enough for now. And honestly, I should probably make myself some new clothing. You know what? I'm going to... Uh, no, I should probably do... Oops. I should probably do this now. My current clothing is about to fall apart. I'm just gonna get rid of these. There we go. Just fling them out outside of town. But yeah, I need some wood if I want to make myself another axe. Eh, I'm fine. I'm gonna go get myself some stone, though. Actually, I think I can get some stone for- ooh. I can get some stone pretty easily on this side of the portal. Or on this tall portal. Looking for some big rocks. Oh, there's one. That was easy. Uh, I think I need a bit more. Alright, I think that's enough stone for now. Yeah, that's enough stone. I'm gonna grab one more, though. Alright, let's head back. Oh, I also need to catch myself a sardine at some point. I'll grab that later. Actually, I'm pretty sure I can just grab a sardine from town. Like, right here. Let's see, got anything yet? There we go. Alright, so let's make that sardine real quick. Uh, where is it? Sardine on a stick. Yeah, we can make a lot more stuff now that we have a barbecue. I'm not sure why we would need a barbecue to make su uh, sashimi, but... Oh well. At least we'll have access to better food in the chest now, too. Alright, so let's make that... Filter fountain. And I think that's every mission that done except for the uh, Farmer Sutra one. And now that I have some better equipment, I feel a bit more confident about going over there and killing that thing. Alright, Filter Fountain. Let's purify the water. So now we have clean water everywhere. I'm going to assume that just purifies the entire town at this point. Alright, as for you, you wanted a sardine on a stick. So here you go. So, let me see. Yeah, you just do need, nah, you two just need to sleep. I mean, the water honestly looks exactly the same as it always has. Oh yeah. Everyone was mentioning about a new type of weapon, something that can attack something flying. So yeah, while Ellie and everyone else are working on the patients, they'll work on a weapon. The exact opposite of medicine. Oh right, and if we want water, we just need to use a bucket. Oh yeah, palm lumber. Actually, palm lumber is perfect. I can make another axe with that. Also, uh, I will take these. Oh wow, that's a lot of healing cream. Yeah, I'll take those too. And those. Perfect. Alright, so before I do anything else, I'm just going to stick everything I don't need away, or put everything I don't need away. Then I'm going to make myself another, I forgot that I can't make wood here. I have to go all the way to the other side, yeah, maybe I should put these two closer together. Oh well. So I'm just going to make some wood. I'm going to make myself a second backup axe in case I need it. Oh, also, I'm going to equip that before I forget. I'm gonna unequip that, because I don't really need it anymore. Gonna build myself a second iron axe, in case I break my first one. And I think I'm good. Alright. And actually, I think I'm gonna end the episode here. So, next time on Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders, we're heading back through that tunnel portal. Oh, and also... 
How much, uh, brick wall did I grab? About 94 pieces. I might need some more. Because, yeah, now that I have a... Oh, I should also grab this and eat it. But now that I have brick walls, I'm also thinking about maybe upgrading the town a bit. Because I don't think I can make cladding yet uh, for walls. If I could, I would. Actually, I can't yet, right? No, I can't, unfortunately. Oh, well. But, yeah, I'll see about maybe upgrading the town's look a bit. And maybe think about building a moat around the town once uh, we're under attack again. But that can wait. Right now, we're safe. So, till next time. I say that and we're immediately under attack. You know what? They can't break walls. I'm fine.